What? I guess I need to trim them that bush thing down with the freaking chainsaw. Elion's trying to do stunts on it. You stuck, man? I guess I need to trim that thing, huh? Okay. I guess, guess I need to trim that down. I've been meaning to anyway. That way you can kind of pull the, the golf cart up right here in the front instead of always having to park in the back. What's up, Tino? What's up, dude? What's up, dude? Alright, so the wind's pretty gusty today. Obviously, very cloudy and a little chilly. But, uh, I think I'm going to play with some tools. Ready to play with some tools, Elio? Yeah! Well, I've been meaning to cut all this stuff down. Ellie hates it. We hate it. And... I might even take the chainsaw and trim them stumps that Elian was just stuck on. So I bought this. I bought this thing off of Amazon for like 15 bucks, and I'm going to put it on this weed eater because there's no way this string is going to cut them stalks over there. All this stuff is like stalks. I mean, thick stuff that a weed eater would never cut with that string. Like all this is just real thick stuff. So definitely need something else besides that string. But I also have to be very careful because it's the same as a chainsaw. You don't want to hit rocks and stuff like this. When I, with when I was actually reading the reviews on this, they said that you don't need anything. You just basically switch it out. So hopefully they're right on this. So it shows here on the back, cup, washer, and nut. And we don't have that. I guess it didn't come with it, so you sell a blade without the stuff that you need. Or maybe it was supposed to be in here, and it ain't. What? What? Who needs a bush cutter anyway? It's looking a little better. I'm just using a regular old weed eater string, whatever. Uh, I'm gonna try to hit them with the weed eater, see if it works. See if it works on those. You gotta start with the top. That's what I did with a lot of these things. Just kind of started with the top and worked my way down. It's starting to look a lot better though. I figure I'll leave that bush, it might come back. Uh, well, probably not this winter, but I don't know. I guess I should just chop it, huh? Huh? Gross? What's gross? What's in it? Are those bugs? What kind of bugs are those? Ew. Touch them again. Huh. Maybe this is going to help get rid of some of these flies and bugs. Shit, this weed eater take tops of them things out. Take a while guess where my weed eater string is. 
It's not here. <laughs> also, depending on using that blade to cut this down, I didn't even bring my weed eater. Because eat this, this is Holly's candle area right now, so yeah. we have to put it into this fast. What? <laughs> Huh? What now? It's talking about your can our our work area in there. Oh. We got to get that done and get you a hot plate to melt wax so you're not doing it in the kitchen. Ellie just showed me her new Avon makeup cover. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. What? Ellie's? Yeah, Ellie got a new Avon catalog in the mail. Oh my God! I would throw that in the trash. <laughs> Hold on, light it back up. Did y'all get a clear shot of that? How evil is that shit? People are gonna say, it's not, a, it, goats aren't evil. Yeah, that is very <laughs> satanic. Goats are not evil. Let's, yeah. Okay, goats are that, not evil. Goats are but, not evil in general, but this, they, it is used. It, yeah, it's it's a... It is symbolism. I'm surprised she doesn't have one eye shut. I'm something. really surprised. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like an eye patch or something on. Wow. Elion, you doing yard work too? Yeah. You doing some yard work? All right, so this video is going to be a little random, I guess. Because now we're going to open up, what is this, a sheet? Is this a bed sheet? It is, it is a sheet, but it's a tapestry. And it's very windy, I don't even know how the sound is. It's probably going to get hung on, on the wall, you know what I mean? Uh-huh. If it's cool. If it's cool. It is very windy, I don't even know how the sound is going to be. Yes. Everyone keeps telling me to pick up rubber bands. Yeah. We do. We just don't show us. Yeah, we just don't show us picking it up, but we pick them up. Awesome! It's hard to see. <laughs> so windy. There you go. Blow it towards you. <laughs> Just fly it around like a kite. We'll, ev we'll eventually get a shot of it. Pretty cool. So you're gonna hang it? Yeah, yeah. A room divider. Let's hang it in our room. We need some decoration in our bedroom. Oh yeah? Let's hang it behind the bed. On that wall. Yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah. Dang right. Yeah, we need some color in our room too. Uh -huh. That's pretty cool. Look at it. It's like a bullseye. Yeah. That's cool. Let's we'll show it when it's dry and hanging. In yeah, we'll hang it on the wall and then we'll show it. It is very windy. Oh my god. Okay, I need some of those thingies. Here's one. Holy crap, it's windy. Well, it'll dry fast. Where they got coffee at the bakery? Yep. Oh shit. What you doing? Not much. Cool. We just riding around, taking a ride. Through the wind, I give in.
Well, that's a whole lot better. <clears throat> Looks a whole lot better. Uh, now I just got to clean up all this stuff everywhere. And I do not have my push broom or rake or anything here yet. So, not sure how I'm going to clean that up. Um, and normally, of course, you would wear safety glasses. I have stuff all in my eyes. But I don't have those here either. So, definitely looks better. We definitely need a new cable line. Our internet is super slow. And I know this this cable line must be pretty old because the, in the house I've done repaired the end like two times this thing came apart. Our internet's super super slow, so I need to figure out where this wire is going, and maybe I can get a new one or either call whatever uh, the internet company is. I think we might be changing to a different place. Here it is, right here. It's going this way. There it is. To there. To right there. And then that's where it looks like it goes underground. So I need a new one. Connect right here. All the way into the house. So I need like a super long one to connect right there. As far as that, I'm guessing it goes to the pole somewhere or something. I don't know. It's definitely going underground right there. If I can find a good deal on this one. Yeah, I'm guessing that's like at least a hundred foot maybe. Once I sweep all this up, it's going to look so much better. And I got to clean these things up and put them back. They're pretty cool looking. It was pretty cool, so I put them back. They were like around the edge like that. I guess that looks pretty cool. Why not? Well, when the tide's up like this, pretty much means you can't, like, drive over to the other side of the neighborhood until pretty much this water goes back, goes back away where it's not uh, up that high. When, the, when there's no water in the grass, you can pretty much travel over to the other side of the neighborhood. So we're kind of stuck until the tide goes down. So, I guess I'm going to start trimming some of this up over here. I mean, it's not really our job or anything like that. Not getting paid for it. Just I figure, might as well just weed eat some of this stuff and make it look a little better. I mean, we have to look at it all the time. So, might as well trim it up. Give it a good trim up. I don't know, maybe get rid of some of this stuff. 
just for the heck of it. And then I believe uh, Captain Terry and Ellie, I believe they're getting some uh, some wood to for a border, and uh, they're getting a bunch of gravel. So I think I'm gonna set up a border and kind of build them a little driveway. And uh, until then, well, it can't get over there until it ties down. So, and I'm just kind of hanging out, not really doing much so I'm gonna trim this stuff up and when we get paid I'm actually we're having electrical problems in the house a lot of a lot of uh, outlets aren't working in the house so we're scared when it gets cold we're scared to really plug up any like space heaters and stuff and I'm actually even scared to even plug up any tools because this box is so old look at this so when we get paid, I'm gonna order another another box and all new breakers. And start wiring this stuff stuff up all new, so we can get some some safe electricity running. That thing's dead, man. We gotta charge it. You keep killing it all the way dead, it's gonna mess the batteries up, man. He don't look. Looks a little better. Definitely need something to cut this big stuff with. That's why I got that bush brush cutter. But weed eater's doing the trick. Guess I need to move that ladder out of there. gonna be a star Elion. I just used a whole spool of string just now. Really? Yeah. Compared to my steel string, that should last for like a month. Jeez. Yeah, this stuff breaks fast. The steel stuff, see, look at the difference. The steel string is a lot more solid and bigger. I don't know why this stuff lasts so much longer, but this is tough. Some tough stuff. That old orange. Yeah. 
These bushes have definitely been growing here a while. Yeah, a long while. We gotta talk to these people about selling this house. This is a pretty cool setup. We'd have fun trying to clean this pool. Huh. I say we just make it a ball pit. Mm, no, nah, we need a pool. About a hundred thousand. We need a pool during balls. the summer. <laughs> you know if we had a fire pit, we could burn this stuff. You gonna make a fire pit? Dude, me and Holly hadn't sat by fire. Oh, I know. It's weird. It's unlike me and Holly to not have a fire pit. <laughs> yeah, it's been about, what, three or four weeks? It's been a while, yeah. <laughs> chainsaw cut a bunch of these trees down they're still laying up there I ain't trying to kill myself today over it but I chopped a bunch of the big trees and stuff so now I just gotta clean all this up I need a rake I need my metal rake so I can rake all of this stuff too once I uh, bring the metal rake and rake all this cut up stuff then I can kind of see where I need to go with the shovel and like dig up some of these roots that that need to die and it'd be very nice if we get our fire pit to burn all this stuff so I don't have to haul it to the trash but it looks a whole lot better though chopped down once it's cleaned up it's gonna look real nice <laughs> <laughs> 